hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be doing a quick last minute thanksgiving slash fall outfits video i don't know what i'm gonna call this yet but i just wanted to give you guys five outfit ideas that are affordable and are last minute so i literally got these out of my closet i didn't do any thanksgiving shopping so yeah Let's just get it started into this video so you guys can see what to wear to your cella. For the first outfit, I paired this rebozo. I don't know what it's called in English. But with some white jeans because I feel like nude and white looks so cute together. And then since I can't make this video long ways, I'm just going to show you guys real quick my heels. Paired it with nude heels. So this is what it looks like. I'll try to include a picture here as well of what it looks like long ways. Um, but yeah, at the end of this video, let me know which outfit you guys like best. And this is from Walmart, by the way. So this was 10 bucks. I found it and I was like, oh, okay, I gotta have it. And then the jeans are from Hollister and the heels from Charlotte Russe, which I don't think is open anymore. But yeah. All right, so the sex one's from Fashion Nova. I think it actually goes like this because it's tight right here, but then this is supposed to be loose. So I think it goes like this. I wish I could get the whole thing. <laughs> I feel like I had to go all the way back here so you guys could see. It has a little belt right here, but it's black, so you can't really see it from far away. Um, but it's very cute. And then I also paired it with the oh how's about to like spread my legs this way paired it with the nude heels i don't know about you guys but i love wearing black i love wearing all black i wear all black to work to go out i just feel so comfortable in it i feel like everyone feels comfortable in it but yeah this is how this next outfit okay, so this is outfit number three um i'm not gonna go too much in detail with this dress because i got it from sheen and it's in my sheen haul which i'll have the link below uh, so you guys could watch it, but this is actually more like a formal dress. It's a little bit above my knee, so this is actually more like formal if you're going to like a party, I would say, or like having a Thanksgiving party. And then I also paired it with the nude heels uh, since the layer under this dress is nude. All right, you guys, so this is the fourth outfit, one of my favorites because the back is like this. The skirt is actually from Blush Mark. It's the ones where it's warm inside so it's so cute and it still has this slit right here this is one of my favorites and by the way you guys if you guys don't know about blush mark you guys have to check out their website they are pretty much just like sheen but more affordable you know how when sheen first started off it was super cheap and now i feel like it went up a couple dollars so you guys definitely want to check out blush mark they are very very affordable and Everything is basically like Sheen. You get your package in those Ziploc bags and their website looks like Sheen where you click on something and then it shows you like a bunch of things like it. So I fell in love with that website and it reminded me of when how Sheen first started. So yeah, everything's like five, 10, 15 bucks. So that is the only reason why I decided to partner up with them because I have had so many companies reach out to me saying if they could send me a product for free in exchange for a shout out but i first look at their products and if they're 60 bucks or super expensive i see no point in that i can't sell something that i wouldn't buy they're probably like one of the first brands that i know for sure they're affordable and i would personally buy it if they didn't send me products for free so yeah I, that was my little rant but Yes, and then I paired this one with some, I paired this with some black heels so it could be matching. And then you could also add like a Charlie hat to this. It would be super cute or a cardigan as well. So yeah, off to the next one. Okay, so that is the last and final outfit, outfit number five. I wanted to include a Vaqueras Vibes outfit in here because the rest are all dressy up. Um, and I know most people nowadays, they wear boots and jeans and the crop tops. So I wanted to show you guys this top from Fashion Hall Co. Uh, I believe I'm pronouncing it right. Or Fashion Hall 
company it's the off the shoulder or you could wear it like this i got so many compliments when i did my little tiktok video of how people dance um but i paired it up with these jeans from fashion nova and then this belt from guadalajara western wear and you could also wear a charlie hat if you'd like to i also have a discount code with them so i will either have it here if i could find it i forgot i believe it's jasmine 10 or makeup by jv i'll look for it i'll look for the discount code and then have it here in the box below so you guys can check them out all right so that was it for my video guys i hope you guys enjoyed i hope this video is no longer than five minutes because i just wanted to show you guys what it looked like i realized that for the last two or three outfits i forgot to show you guys what it looked like on the screen so i will probably take pictures in those outfits and post them on my instagram you guys go follow me on instagram if you guys already don't it's makeup by jv um a lot of people call me Mubi. They think Mubi is my name, but my name is Jasmine, you guys. M-U-B-Y-J-V stands for Makeup by Jasmine Vega. Just wanted to clear the air because I see some of you guys in person and you guys are like, hi, Mubi JV. And I'm like, I really got to change my name. I am considering changing my name, but since everyone knows me by that name now, like, I don't know. Help me with ideas. Give this a thumbs up if you guys like this video. And sorry if I didn't come out with cute outfits but see you guys in my next video